And when I said that to him, he, he looked that thing up and I said, it means something. I don't know why, but I said I was a heathen out there. But I said, I want the real thing of God. I didn't want my counterfeit. I didn't want no somebody come by at that time or whatever. I want the real thing. So when you speak a word, I want to see manifestation of it. Because if he said I have the power, and I said, this man, if I said I'm a new creature, I said, okay, God, I need you to do what you said. And I thank God for it because he always tells me, remember what God said to us. Yes. And when I see God uses him, I say, I know he is the man. So I'm just telling y'all how good it's been being a Christian and married to Sammy James for almost 36 years with two extra years making 38 years that I see what God is doing because it is blowing my mind. Amen. It is blowing my mind. I'm just going to tell y'all. Father's side. Didn't like him either. 
But I'm just saying, if I could have time to tell you that, it was amazing. But I, I knew it was predestined from the beginning of time for God to have me and him to, and I to be together. And I thank God for it. Because it's blown me away to see what God is doing with the two little people from Mississippi. Well, Mississippi and Louisiana. In Georgia. Yeah. In Georgia. Yeah. It's amazing. I, I just buckle up now. On the, on the roller coaster ride, you know how you buckle up? And he said, hold tight to me, baby. Right. He always said, hold tight to me. And I, he said, I got you. And you sit back in that roller coaster ride, and then he takes me off. And I just said, God, I thank you. Because I trust him most of all. But I know that you hear from him, so I trust you. So I present to you Pastor Sammy James, the lover of my life.